This video is made possible by Ranger Rob Poopy Bags, available on Amazon right now. Good morning from Central Oregon Living in Homestead. I'm Ranger Rob. My wife is Sherry. Thank you for watching our channel. Right before I get started today, today's rotor tiller day. Uh, but I wanted to talk about really quick some of the other things we, we do here. Uh, when you watch our channel, you probably see the Ranger Rob Poopy Bag um, beginning. And reason being is that's how we grow our channel to pay for all of our toys. Anyway, uh, <laughs> so we make the Ranger Rob Poopy Bag. Uh, and the reason I started uh, making these bags is uh, Sherry and I did a lot of traveling. And we ended up using bags at parks and stuff like that. And I really like the bags with handles. And But I wanted one that was a little larger and wider uh, and uh, mm -hmm. strong and lightweight at the same time. So I created Ranger Rob Poopy Bags, which are available on Amazon. Uh, they're very affordable. Uh, we're actually right same price as everybody else out there. We also make the Ranger Rob Poopy Bags the same size on rolls. And uh, this one comes with a dispenser. And you get that on Amazon too. So that's the purpose behind Ranger Rob Poopy Bags. Is One is I wanted to make a better bag. And two, uh, have something that helps support the channels and the other things we do. Which, what are the other things we do? <laughs> well, we also have a radio station. Uh, we own Good Talk Radio, and then we have several podcasts. On this channel, you probably have seen me do a half-hour show called Easy Street, but we have several others, too. And we support a radio station as a uh, Christian base, but not over the top, um, and conservative, and uh, uh, plays great uh, uh, classic rock, and uh, has some really good talk shows from all over the United States. So uh, I urge you to go check out, just go to the internet and go Good Talk Radio, goodtalkradio.com, and uh, uh, you can also pull us up on TuneIn on Alexa. Just go say, uh, Alexa, go to TuneIn and play Good Talk Radio. Say it nice and clear, and sure and heck, it will come on up. So that's kind of what that's all about. But today, I got two things I got to show you. One is, one really big box came in today, yes, a couple days ago. This is my 30 by 30 tarp, which is going to cover my spring garden. And so uh, uh, today, we're going to break out this new, <laughs> amongst the mess, my new uh, earthquake uh, rotor tiller. And uh, I got oil in it. I got to add some fuel. And we're going to start cutting up the ground. And what I want to do is first is cut up the ground, clean it out, any roots that come up, any rocks, things like that. Phase two will be putting additives in the ground. Uh, I'm going to add a lot of stuff from some po old pots and dirt and um, potting material in there. And then we're going to go purchase some manure blend that in and then when I'm happy the way it looks uh, then we're going to cover it for the winter and uh, that'll kill out any weeds we have left and uh, uh, any you know from the pottery uh, pots and stuff like that we're going to have old plants and stuff like that all that stuff will be blended in we don't care what it looks like because we know in the spring it'll all be dead and mixed in so uh, this is the beginning of getting that spring um, garden going. So let's get started. Well, this baby fired right up and uh, looks like we're about ready to uh, get started. So uh, let's take it out there and see how she performs.
Well, I got halfway through. That thing definitely beats the heck out of you. Uh, not really too bad, except that when you hit a rock, boy, does that baby let you know it. And so, this is good. This is the chance to churn up the ground, tear out any roots, and uh, I can't believe this thing is so hard. It takes the wind out of you. Um, gives us a chance to get the big rocks out. And uh, just think I gotta do it again once we add mulch. And uh, not mulch, but we gotta add manure and potting soil. So uh, hopefully the second round is a little easier than the first. But yeah. And uh, that nice, nice shiny uh, rototiller ain't so shiny anymore. But uh, boy, am I stirring up the dust. I told you our. our our uh, dirt here is real sandy, so it's going to take a lot to uh, build up the soil. So uh, anyway, take a little break, then I'm going to start her up again. Okay guys, round two, here we go. Right, guys this is round three I'm going for it this time this thing really tuckers you out <laughs> so here we go interrupt this program for a little puppy playtime. Come here, you two. Well guys, I'm spent. I got the whole thing all rototilled and uh, that sun was getting kind of hot, pretty dusty. Anyway, the earthquake uh, worked really well. It's not too overpowering, even though you're still tuckered out after using it. Uh, ran nice, did what exactly what I wanted to do. and. Uh, Next step is to put additives in the dirt and do it again. So I want to thank you for watching. Please take the time to subscribe. And please, uh, right now, would you like the video? Those always help. And uh, share our videos, would you? We'd love to have more people to our family, help our channel grow. So go to YouTube if you're on YouTube already. Uh, if not, come to YouTube and subscribe. We'd love to have you. And please leave your comments below and say hello. And uh, we've uh, actually got some of our buckets in today. So we're going to split that lime I told you we bought uh, with my son. And uh, uh, we also have another cultivator, edger, and uh, dredger kind of little thing coming. 
uh, should be in today. So lots of things happening. And uh, let's see what else. Oh, in about a week, we're actually going to get baptized. Um, I'm actually been baptized when I was a child, but I'm reaffirming. And my wife is baptizing for the first time, so we're pretty excited about that. So anyway, guys, till next time, bye now. Thank you very much for watching our video. Please take the time to like, subscribe, and share our videos all over the whole wide world. Thanks.